daytime violence. Atlanta police investigating two separate shootings that happened in broad daylight. Officers say a fight may have led to a lunchtime drive by at Oak Atlanta on Ivan Allen Jr. Boulevard. No one was hurt, but the building was riddled with bullets. Nearly three hours later, police were called to a second shooting on Markham Street across from Mercedes Benz Stadium. One man was taken to the hospital with serious injuries. Police are still searching for the suspect. Georgia is moving closer to repealing a longtime law. Citizens arrest has been on the state books since 1863. It allows people who are not sworn law enforcement officers to make arrests, but efforts to end the practice are gaining support following the fatal shooting of Ahmad Aubrey. The three men charged with his murder told authorities they chased Aubrey, who was jogging because they believe he'd committed a crime. Last month, Governor Kemp announced a bill repealing the law. In the past 24 hours, it won unanimous support from Georgia's House Judiciary Committee and could move to a full vote soon. Broadband announcement. Earlier this year, Governor Brian Kemp promised millions of dollars to boost access to broadband in rural areas. And today, he plans to make an announcement about that access. The governor will join state officials and Tri-County EMC in Central Georgia later this morning. This visit is about getting internet access to some of those rural areas.